Okay, Leon's describing a linear graph. A graph. It's a linear graph. So that means it goes in a straight line. Negative gradient. That means it goes from uh, goes downhill as it goes from left to right, uh, and it goes through the origin, which is zero zero. So I just need to draw a straight line going down downwards, which goes through there, and that will do. K described graph. It's a cubic graph. So a cubic graph goes something like that, or maybe a negative one like so and when x is positive y is positive so x is positive y has got to be up here so it's not allowed to go into this bit here and it's only can cross the x-axis once only can cross the x-axis once here it can't be a negative cubic because if it was that's a negative cubic and that's a positive one because the negative cubic, this bit here would eventually go into the bit down here which I mustn't have so it can't be that it has to be something like that. It can only cross the x-axis once, so it's going to have to come up. That'll do quite nicely. Uh, it's definitely cubic. It's got that shape, that sort of S-shape. Uh, only crosses the x-axis once, and it doesn't go into this region down here. And you just have to very slowly build those things up. That's question 11 done.